Oh, hi, Mateo. How are you? Fine, and thank you. And you? I'm fine. I am taking the care of the of this pandemic that is so hard for the world. And you, yeah, are you taking care? Yes, I am. Oh, okay. You know, in this pandemic, I have had time to think a lot of many historical things. You know? Yeah, and I've been thinking about the impact of literature in society. That I think that literature is one of the oldest and most effective communicative and dismantling formats of culture and knowledge in history, acting as a record of it. Um, I think that it's very important the literature to like know other cultures of other people or other countries because the authors of the books or something are like um, writing their ideas on or their point of view of many different topics. Oh, I know that in those times, they started the nonverbal literature that was from the very first Indians that lived in America. Also, I know about the author called Jonathan Edwards and he did a book that I read in my school. Can you tell yeah. me a little more about what you know? Yeah, this is about the Puritan movement in America. And as a question, as a, as a consequence of the failure of the Puritan government, many of them left the country looking for other places with whether religion or freedom, um, such as Switzerland, Holland, South Africa, and mainly the English colonies in America. Um, the arrival of the Puritans in the English colonies of America was the opportunity to establish the kind of government that they would not establish in England. There were, there, there they would found the largest number of Puritan communities in America. From a much of the character oh. of what would later become America. America Puritan has been execrated by America's cinema and literature. Oh, very interesting. And tell me, tell me an author you know about these literatures that I think is wonderful. Yeah, for the past 80 years of thought, the truth is that without them, current American culture would not be understood. Americans were painfully aware of their excessive dependence on the model of English literature. The search for his own literature beca became a national obsession that literally independence of the United States was delayed by its president in the, in the identification with England by an excessive desire of eliminate English or classical literature models. And because it is difficult economy and political conditions prevent the production of texts and books. Oh, now well, I'm happy because I know a little bit more than I understand. Oh, Mateo, now, now I'm happy because I know a little bit more about this early American literature. I think it's pretty important for the future generations and to the actual generation to know more about this early American literature because help us to have better values and to bloom with as a better generation in the future. We know that in these times that the world is going crazy, we know that the values are just like going off and now we have to be a better society in a better youth. Yeah, so also, I think it's important that people like you also know all the more words about this. talk about the human being, about love and hatred, passion, goodness, and or vanity, for example. In every literary work, our greatest virtues and our worst defects will be reflected. All those social behaviors caused by this or that event and that is precisely the function of each other. Remind us what we are and how we work. Oh, okay. Oh, Mateo, it was so good to talk to you. Now I have to say goodbye because I have to talk with my, with my, with my neighbors. Okay, Bye, thank Mateo. you. It was a pleasure to have you here. Bye.